Hi everyone, uh, this is uh, Sam Newsom. Uh, a few days ago, I posted a picture on Facebook uh, showing my new contraption here uh, where I've attached a plastic tube to the soprano saxophone in order to extend its range and it's, and it's great for playing a drone. And mind you, you know, this is not the type of thing you want to try to take to a jam session and blow a couple of courses on rhythm changes on. You know, this is something you want to use in a more, if you want to say, sound-centered approach. Um, so let me just explain to you what it is. Well, it's kind of in three parts here. You know, you have your body coil, and then you have here, I guess what you would call the neck that goes into the body. And thanks to some pretty fancy corking by Roberto Romeo, uh, he, was, uh, he was able to put a cork on so I can uh, make the mouthpiece more firmly planted. So I'm going to attach it here to the neck of the soprano. And um, just demonstrate you know, how it's used for, for me. You know, I use the technique of circular breathing. As you know, circular breathing is when you simultaneously inhale air through the nose while pushing out stored air in the cheeks from the cheeks, uh, given the impression of creating a continuous flow of air. So yeah, so let me give it a try. It's not always consistent, but uh, you know, let's hope luck is on my side. Okay, so you see, you know, you get into some cool sounds. You know, this is something I certainly want to try to pursue more when I do more of my solo shows. So check it out. I'll be posting some more because, as you can imagine, with the different size tubes, you get a different register and different harmonics. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching.